our cleaning up is proof we are persuaded, fully persuaded, it will be a good day. So we put on the shirt, sleep on the jacket, strap our shoes, Grab the bag, pick the car key, and we are ready to open that door to what the day has behind it. But stop! As you both set out in the morning, ready to pour yourselves into your work, stop, wait a minute, slow down a little, come back, hold her hands, place yours in his. You may lock up in an embrace, it's fine. You may rest on his chest, that's cool. Take a deep breath and say a short prayer. Speak into her day, prophesy into his. No, this is different from family devotion. It is way different from quiet time. This is speaking. Don't make it long. You can keep it short if you want. Yes, I know you already prayed when you woke up in the morning. This is different. This is speaking. This is speaking as one with authority. This is a declaration from one who has the authority. Agree on what the day should be. Establish for yourselves how you want it. Speak! Speak! The lines fall for him in pleasant places. Jehovah shields her continually with favor. The hand of God be upon her for good. The spirit of excellence rests upon him all day. He makes right decisions today. A heart indicts of a good matter. Sovereign God garrisons our hearts with peace. The Almighty keeps him from all evil. Speak! Speak! Declare it! Speak into the day. Decide what the hours will supply. Do it on Monday. Make it happen on Tuesday. Show up on Wednesday. Report on Thursday. Thank God it's Friday. Saturday's got nothing on you. It's a new page on Sunday. It is not in the length of the prayer, it's in the consistency. It's not in the loudness of the petition, it's in the commitment to it. It's less than 60 seconds, 